today uh, we'll discuss about this uh, AWS uh, Elastic Beanstack. Sorry, uh, AWS Beanstack. Let me share my screen with you. This uh, Elastic Beanstack comes under the category of this compute services of AWS. From here you can see that. So what this Elastic Beanstack is. Uh, uh, assume that there is a scenario where you had uh, multiple developers uh, uh, and your project manager divided or your team leader divided uh, that project to uh, different modules and assign one one module to each developer so and you had one centralized uh, repository where uh, server where you will store all the code so let us assume a developer did some he completed his module and he wanted to check these modules output so where can he do that for uh, for checking that let us assume he's working on web server for checking that he needs some web server right so for each and every developer you you cannot provide the web servers right or or you cannot uh, it's like a scenario you'll have only one web server for your development environment where after modifying all the modules of different uh, developers they'll commit to centralized repository from there you'll build a build and from that build you deploy that build to this centralized server or whatever it is a centralized web server from there you'll see the output of all the developers what if you wanted to see the output of that module that one developer worked on that so for these reasons so uh, let me draw a diagram for you for your better understanding on this Guys, be on hold. Uh, I think my bamboo pads uh, sells uh, charging IP not tonight, so I was unable to write that. Uh, let me replace the batteries of it. Just be on hold.
guys uh, na bamboo pad uh, sells i pay so i cannot write it so for the, for to make a purchase i have to move to outside so what we will do so uh, beanstack is nothing and uh, with the help of this beanstack service it will create an environment for to check your code what you have uh, did so it's like simply you upload your code so beanstack service is an saas service of aws he is offering that service to you as an saas model so just you upload your code before uploading you have to provide what type of code is yours whether it is java based code like you have to provide all the attributes uh, so that it will provide the infrastructure aws guy will provide the infrastructure to run that code so he will take care of that size to handle that code size of the infrastructure that is required to handle that code so whatever it is so he'll take care of the infrastructure or pass level whatever so just here he is offering the beanstack service to as a saas service so that it is used for checking the output of that uh, particular code what we did the development on the middle of the development or such kind of scenario so we just upload our code so that on the back end of the aws guy will take care he will manage the code he will uh, what we call he will uh, manage the uh, resources or prerequisites that are required for running that code uh, let me directly go to the console and we'll, we'll go see. open up the elastic bin stack so and this bin stack services are restricted to every region so here what he is saying with elastic bin stack you can deploy monitor and scale an application quickly and easily let us do the heavy lifting so you can focus on your business his intention of stating these sentences indirectly he is saying that we will take care of the infrastructure we will take care of the application we will take care of all the operating system whatever it is so you don't bother about this just you upload your code you deploy your code on this bean stack and you monitor and also you can scale that very easily and quickly let us say we'll see we'll start with a sample application deployment okay uh it could be simply opinion we have to select a platform what kind of platform we need to run the code here beanstack supports this kind of php kind of basic platform ruby code windows server 2012 tomcat node different different kind of application servers this beanstack servers supports so first we have to select a platform so that we'll start with it getting started so application name give any some application name you are you are going to provide application name uh, upload right so let us say i'll name it as test case 44 just for our remembrance we are naming it the application name next choose what platform uh, whether i'll go with uh, java okay as an example of this what i'll do now uh, any sample application or do you have any uh, java code that is with you so that you can upload that zip file or war file of that uh, website normal ga enti ante andi developers uh, code develop chesaka they'll zip that entire code and they'll host that zip file in application server akada petti application server ni okka sar restart chesthe ఆ జిప్ లో ఉన్న ఫైల్స్ అన్నిటిని అప్లికేషన్ సర్వర్ అబ్జర్వ్ చేసి అది ఒక వార్ ఫైల్ బిల్డ్ చేస్తుంది డాట్ వార్ ఆ ఫైల్ నేమ్ ఆ ఫోల్డర్ నేమ్ డాట్ వార్ గా సో వార్ ఫైల్ ఏంటి అంటే ఫ్రమ్ దట్ వార్ ఫైల్ వీ కాల్ వీ ఇంటిగ్రేట్ ఆల్ ద సోర్స్ కోర్స్ సి డెవలపర్ ఒక ఫైల్ లో హిల్ రైట్ సమ్ థౌజండ్స్ ఆఫ్ లైన్స్ అలా కొన్ని థౌజండ్ ఫైల్స్ ఉంటాయి ఆ ఫైల్స్ అన్నిటిని కలిపి ఒక కోడ్ గా ఒక ప్రాజెక్ట్ లాగా ఇచ్చేది వీ కాల్ ఇట్ యాజ్ వన్ వార్ ఫైల్ ఓకే if you had that war file just upload the war file here he is saying uh, before that upload ante system ch upload cheyachu ledante s3 lo ekkadanna bucket lo petti aa bucket path kodu ichi upload cheyachu so for this sample we'll go with sample website sample application enti ante he will provide you an sample static website 
తన దగ్గర ఏదో ఒక వెబ్సైట్ ఉంది ఆ వెబ్సైట్ని అప్లోడ్ చేస్తాడు ఆ కోడ్ని ఇట్స్ లైక్ క్రియేట్ అప్లికేషన్ ఆర్ వీల్ గో అండ్ సీ వాట్ ఆర్ ద మోర్ ఆప్షన్స్ కాన్ఫిగర్ మోర్ ఆప్షన్స్ so what kind of environment you wanted you are going to see for this scenario tan em chestunnadu ante back end lo he is launching a t2.micro instance okay uh ante have you heard about the docker it's a similar concept of docker he he is naming his environment e environment name chestunnadu ante low cost environment and vaadi name chestunnadu if, if you wanted to deploy this java website with high availability environment he is telling you that this is what changes he'll give you an load balancer he'll introduce an load balancer failover cases lo four instances launch chestunnadu ikkada sample application ki no na application ki me decide cheskovalante then go for this custom uh, upload and from there you can specify all these things so on the back end he is creating all the prerequisites that are required like he is creating one environment he launched one instance he is deploying uh, he is creating one environment so he pull what environment to create our data ni he pulled it from amazon s3 storage bucket oka bucket nunchi environment details teeskunnadandi teeskoni now he started from that environment details he started creating one environment environment ante telusu meeku telusu development environment untundi testing environment untundi qa environment untundi software as dlc software development life cycle we have different environments right oka environment depending upon the product what you are developing the environment are different for example you are developing e-commerce website you will have one web server you will have one database and application unta application server the three servers unta in environment lo he provided an elastic ip to that our environment so that i said you whenever you switch off power or or power on the instance a instance oka public ip change avvadu ante then you have to go with elastic ip for that instance it's like scenario video e e test case scenario ki he is not charging any price and but for this scenario for setting up the environments you have to launch an instance for launching that instance he'll charge you you have to create one elastic ip for creating an elastic ip he'll charge you so what he is integrating e e output raw and he is calling all the different other services of aws right for that ప్రైస్ ఉంటే వాటికి కాస్టింగ్ ఉంటే ఆ కాస్ట్ ఛార్జ్ అవుతుంది సో వాట్ హీ డైట్ ఫస్ట్ స్టెప్ లో హి సైడ్ క్రియేటింగ్ ఎన్వైర్మెంట్ ఈ స్టార్ట్ అడ్ ఎట్ నైన్ ట్వంటీ టూ ఏఎం after that using elastic beanstack as amazon s3 storage bucket for environment data storage ki environment data store cheyadaniki he is using a bucket s3 s3 vaartunnadu 
ओके हाईस्टल और बैकेट क्रिएट जैसे डे इलास्टिक बीन्स टाइप एपी साउथ अनो का बैकेट क्रिएट जैसे अब दादी स्टोरेज का वार्ड तूना डो नेक्स्ट चेंज जैसे डो दान को आईपी एड्रेस इच्छा डो इलास्टिक आईपी अंदर तो का सेक्युरिटी ग्रुप क्रिएट जैसे डो एडब्ल्यूएस ईबीएन अनेम तो 923 की so, in 923, he said that there are no instances to perform this uh, transitions like environment health kind of thing, monitoring services. First, again, he went for launching an EC2 instance, wait for, waiting for EC2 instance to launch. This may take a few minutes. Now, okay, instance launch is said, EC2 instance, instance unique idea of CD to your environment. Still, it's creating on the back end. He's, he's adding the instance. After that, you have to install the softwares and packages that, that are required to run the Java code. Miro, could Pakat have opened this with them whether he is really launching a new instance? I'll go to EC2, Mumbai EC2. Yes, he launched one instance. To set a sample ENVN launch yesterday. April launch yesterday. December 6th, morning 9.23, just, just before 2 3 minutes. So then IP address in which I do, 35.154.49.49. Yeah, here what, this is Elastic IP. So, Elastic IP, Elastic IP, Elastic IP is on each other. So, Elastic IP is in one of the left cell network in the village. So, then you can Elastic IP, this one, then you can look at this instance. Still he is creating. So now he is adding environments. Instance launch in the packages have installed just so much back end. And the back end he Tanu Wadu on something a script as bit Kronandi. Java Unapuru e environment setup chia look instance launch. He is running on the back end, he is running his script and he is performing that actions through APIs, application programming interface. So normal game entity steps and you manual the channel. Okay, instance launch is then Java install is then elastic IP, then go security group at chase. So here in just you he said we uploaded our code or for sample website kill them. Then cowards and prerequisites and the water is going to know. So now this is what he launched one environment. And that environment name is test case 44. Under that environment, we had uh, environment health condition is okay. So, configuration health attack right side low. You can observe that he launched one instance, and the instance operating system is 64 bit Amazon Linux. His own operating system he used for launching that instance. Okay, and he installed Java 8 on that instance. Because we need to run the Java code. So these are all the events occurred while launching the environment. When we have a black color console using the away events This is what the dashboard of this environment. Let's go to configuration part of that environment. So he we launched only single instance. Okay, instance launch is the environment type low. And the instance model is t2.micro, type is t2.micro. Availability zone one year one below one system availability zone law 
launch as and we haven't enabled any notification service on that instance so updates are disabled managing updates are disabled health something kind of thing coming to logs from here you can see if you do any changes in this environments or any error occurs here you can see the logs and the health of that environment under particular instance you can observe from here this is what the instance the status is okay it's running from past 8 minutes and jeptunaro so when a different different how many requests came for that environment at a uh, environment on the page load trade and key i which latency and then the in the load average so it will serve what is the cpu utilization of that environment right now that monitoring parameters or the values you can observe from here you can enter the graph level low, metrics level low he'll show you everything right away the the, the environment is using six percent of CPU utilization and max network inflow just if I am be watching the outflow just 215 KB alone this is for past three hours you can range the time also okay it's coming to alarms if you wanted to <coughs> create an alarm there are no alarms defined for it so monitoring dashboard on the other you can change alarm create yes coach call on the So if you wanted to enable the automatic updates of that particular Java version or any updates application based updates or operating system based updates that you can manage and have complete environment updates or the deployment kind of updates version 1 version 2 everything you can manage from here. So these are all the events performed and the times and the uh, eco uh, statements so if you want he named the tags for this environment as name tag of each other different different type of correct tags each other tag values for his remembrance so I wanted to see whether the sample website is deployed on that website or not so where is that uh, what is the IP address of that website Okay, instance launch so instance IP address into let me click on this IP address. So I'll copy this IP address and I'll paste this IP address in the new browser so that I, the website has to be loaded. Congratulations. The first AWS Binstack Java application is now running and you're what dedicated. So it is load. So if you if you have another custom kind of uh, a web page one second uh, download java sample java website
సో ఒక వార్ ఫైల్ డౌన్లోడ్ ఇచ్చాడు వాట్ ఐ డూ ఐ విల్ అప్లోడ్ దిస్ వార్ ఫైల్ ఇట్స్ ఇన్ కార్తిక్ డౌన్లోడ్స్ సో ఫ్రమ్ హియర్ అప్లోడ్ ఈ న్యూ డిప్లాయ్మెంట్ చూస్ ఫైల్ go to downloads okay deploy సో ఎన్విరాన్మెంట్ హెల్త్ ఈస్ డీగ్రేడెడ్ లెట్ ఎస్ సీ వాట్ ఈస్ ద ప్రాబ్లమ్ దట్ కాస్ట్ కంప్లీట్ అవ్వండి విల్ సీ Environment Health has transferred from OK to Degrade. Application update in progress. One out of one instance completed. Running of the impaired services. New application version was deployed. New application version was deployed to you. I'm running this. It is Environment Update complete successfully. Okay. Let me see whether I got that output or not. Refresh. Bad gateway. So on the back end he is using not Apache. He is using Nginx. what is the finer to error finer to so what i'll do i'll restart this instance let us once restart might me actions reboot yes reboot
అప్పయింది కానీ మళ్ళీ సేమ్ అదే బ్యాడ్ ఎరర్ గేట్వే వస్తుంది గేట్వే ఎరర్ వస్తుంది అంటే ఐ థింక్ ఆన్ ద శాంపుల్ వెబ్ అప్లికేషన్ హీఈస్ నాట్ అలోయింగ్ అస్ టు అప్లోడ్ అనదర్ అనదర్ డిప్లాయ్మెంట్ వర్షన్ ఇక్కడ ఏంటి అంటే ఒకసారి ఎన్విరాన్మెంట్ సెట్ చేశాక ప్రతిసారి డెవలపర్ విల్ డూ ద చేంజెస్ ఆన్ హిస్ కోడ్ కదండి so for every time when he wanted to check that uh, code output what he has to do he has to upload that var file or build file from here and he has he has to see that output In that scenario he will maintain the version numbers he health degrade ayindi just give it some time it will come back to బికాస్ ఇందాక రీబూట్ చేస్తాం కదా సిస్టమ్ అంటే అండ్ ద బ్యాక్ అండ్ మైట్ బీ హీ హాస్ రిటర్న్ హెల్త్ మానిటరింగ్ సర్వీసెస్లో కొన్ని మినిట్స్ ఉంటాయి కదా ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ ఇఫ్ మై సర్వర్ రెస్పాన్స్ కంటిన్యూస్లీ ఫర్ త్రీ మినిట్స్ ఐ విల్ కన్సిడర్ మై సర్వర్ హెల్త్ యాజ్ ఓకే ఇఫ్ మై సర్వర్ డజన్ రెస్పాండ్ కంటిన్యూస్లీ ఫర్ త్రీ మినిట్స్ ఐ విల్ కన్సిడర్ మై సర్వర్ హెల్త్ ఈజ్ డౌన్ లైక్ దట్ మైట్ బీ ఫర్ రికవరింగ్ హీ హాస్ రిటర్న్ ఎ లాంగ్ పీరియడ్ or else we can go and we can create a new environment so web server environment or what kind of environment you wanted to create uh, i wanted to create an web server environment what is the difference between web server environment this work environments when you are doing the development process like integrating with other services of aws like amazon sqs in that scenarios uh you'll go with work environments when you're dealing with website or web servers web based kind of applications then we prefer you to go with web server environment because at the final your application will serve to the clients through website only Uh, i can go with tomcat uh, sample application upload your code what is my upload i had recently local file where it is sample okay i uploaded the local var file ఓకే వర్షన్ నేమ్ వర్షన్ లేబుల్ ఏదైనా ఇవ్వండి లైక్ వి వన్ ఫర్ మై రిమెంబరెన్స్ వర్షన్ వన్ ఓకే బిఫోర్ దాట్ వాట్ ఐ డూ ఐ ఐ డెలీట్ ద ప్రీవియస్ ఎన్రోమెంట్ ఎందుకంటే మళ్ళీ డబుల్ డబుల్ ఛార్జ్ అవుతుంది అండి where is it elastic bean stack this is what the environment right go to environment actions terminate environment just terminate creating the environment adding instances to the environment or terminating the environment or configuring the environment details i mean instance on the software scanning and then enabling the monitoring on that environments deploying the code on the environment and maintaining the version number on that deployments so everything this elastic bin stack is handling we we have to bother about just uploading the code delete and then it's submitting and the normal guy they 
what you'll do you you go for the uh, ec2 instance you power off that ec2 instance you detach the elastic ip for that ec2 instance it's a different scenario when you go for manual it, it's let us assume that it is like an automation where it is providing you the infrastructure it is providing you an uh, operating system or application to run your environment so it is terminated concept package box put in the upper the content will go with new create new environment web based environment select uh, platform I'll go with Tomcat Tomcat application server launch at them sample website to chessy name in the car download is no code uh, upload your code Kelly what is my code this is what my code okay I'll name it as version 1 upload create environment now is in creating a new environment and he's deploying a tomcat about that environment and okay now we create this and look instance launch yes or instance law tomcat uh, soft, uh, software is then pina you are file better than just to start website lo. first environment second adding the instances to the environment third installing the softwares like tomcat or java or php depending upon your requirement installing the softwares on that instances fourth uploading the code on that environment or on that instance or on that application what you have installed java or tomcat and serving it through web or we can call it as seeing the output Guys, any doubts on this topic? If you have doubts, just ask me in the middle. Last week, and the country diagram said and can a notepad could have punch it. Little so, mere mind low pet calls in the Indian day. Elastic Beanstalk is in SaaS service of AWS where. On the back end, he'll take care of everything, creating the environment, all everything. So, and while creating the Elastic Bean Stack, the first step is you have to provide the application name, I'm or else I can say that environment name. The second step is uh, you have to upload your code. The third step is what kind of code you are uploading. Just tell that. Environment health has transactions from pending to okay. Initialization complete 10 seconds ago and took 2 minutes. Any doubts you had guys on this topic? So we successfully created one environment. Let us see. Then game IP address is shadow. 
in moment key he given an IP address of uh, I'll go and see are they instance with the launch is at Uncode create yes, sir. The ampere hyphen one and extra vector in the IP address. This is what the IP address. I'll copy this IP address and let me paste that IP address. Control V. Okay, I got a sample website. Sample hello world application. Okay. Or if you have any other Tomcat based uh, uh, application sample website war file and the developers develop chase war files and the developers card cover the other got it internet to download just want to know more files the war set up and download is the Monday we'll upload this and we'll see this is different oh Panjit them Jenkins server and Jedama Jenkins war file and we'll download this Jenkins war file and we'll paste it in Tomcat and we'll see whether we can start Parma links to the latest. These are all the war file versions. Huh? What is the latest version? 2.35. Okay. Okay. It's in 65 MB. Okay. Uh, do you know the Jenkins server? CA and CD server. On the back end at AWS, we had code, uh, uh, code deploy and code pipeline. Jenkins and TNT and the deployment process ni automate chair and give uses Jenkins server and where it will pull the code from the source code and it will build up this war files and it will push that war files into this uh, application servers or web servers for that we use this Jenkins for continuous integration and continuous deployment for every deployment it will maintain a versioning if something happens you can revert back the deployment
so it's still downloading 44 45 so where is that upload button here it is upload and deploy Click on upload. Where is that file in my downloads? Choose file. Uh, go for downloads. What is that file name? Jenkins J E N. Here it is that our file. Okay. Deploy. Now it is uploading from my system to the Oh, so fast to upload out and then it is uploading very slow. Why is my upload speed is less? What is my upload speed? Speed test. Six percent of the data. Oh my god. They put upload a So any doubts you had guys on this? Bharat, any doubts? I'm not happy. from your side no doubts. Bharat about you? I know I'm not happy. And Raghava, doubts on this topic? Hello? No. Simple and decree in JSM and normal gay te okay instance L easy to service kill look instance launch AC and instance or login a yakada install just some Tomcat server gani and instance IP address. This is time the chala time taken process. You could ain't elastic bin stack code upload JC. What kind of code? Java, na, Tomcat based, PHP, ya, and made specify yes, the Dan Kita good calls in instances automatically, it will back end, it will create, it will launch, and it will just give us the output by entering that IP address. We can see the output of that website, whatever it is. So he is, and the what he'll say whenever we go with AWS uh, Bean Stack and type just on internet, I'll show you what is AWS Bean Stack. 
Amazon Web Services comprises dozens of services. Uh, see, with Elastic Beanstack, you can quickly deploy and manage web applications in the AWS cloud. So I, what I did, I uploaded my application, and he's and I was managing because I specified the whatever it is. He provided the infrastructure. You without worrying about the infrastructure that runs those applications because he is handling the application infrastructure. He'll take care of that. Even I cannot SSH into that server. So sir, is e server ke SSH chaudan ki na ki kar key pair leto. Ante login avolen. But he is charging us because he launched the servers for us. Then he charges to not. But I cannot log in and I cannot manage it. He will manage this infrastructure. He is the whole responsible if something happens to this instance or the data that is uploaded into that instance. And we can see the instance health status and everything. You'll have a health monitoring dashboard. From the dashboard, you can see the health instance status. Sorry, elastic green stack. And the can even compute can be better. Green color on the color. Green color on the oh, you running good eh? dashboard kill them. Environment dashboard key. Health is good. Running test case 44 source v1. Path of the inka is upload all the cover. Back end low he used Amazon Linux operating system 64 bit and he installed Tomcat 8 and Java 8. We could have chosen that small small size war file. It is taking a lot of time. My internet is slow, that's the reason. I think these are all the sample war files. These are not all files. He is telling us to install. He is. Uh, it's not a genuine. And even application war files, even project war files.
ఈ వార్ ఫైల్స్ ఎలా క్రియేట్ చేస్తారంటే డెవలపర్స్ దిల్ రైట్ ద కోడ్ ఆన్ దిస్ దేర్ పీసీ కదా ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ లెటర్స్ అజ్యూమ్ జావా డెవలపర్ జావా డెవలపర్ విల్ యూజ్ ద సాఫ్ట్వేర్ కాల్ జావా ఎక్లిప్స్ ఆర్ జావా కెప్లర్ ఫర్ రైటింగ్ ద కోడ్ సో హిల్ రైట్ ద కోడ్ ఫ్రమ్ దట్ ఫ్రమ్ దేర్ హీ కెన్ క్రియేట్ ఏ వార్ ఫైల్ ఆ టూల్ యూజ్ చేసుకొని హీ కెన్ క్రియేట్ ఏ వార్ ఫైల్ అండ్ ఈవెన్ విత్ ద హెల్ప్ ఆఫ్ ద జెన్కిల్స్ ఆల్సో వీ కెన్ క్రియేట్ ఏ వార్ ఫైల్ బై పుల్లింగ్ ద కోడ్ ఫ్రమ్ ద సోర్స్ కోడ్ అండ్ వీ కెన్ క్రియేట్ ఏ బిల్డ్ ఆ బిల్డ్ అనే వార్ ఫైల్ అంటాం బిల్డ్ అంటే నథింగ్ బట్ బిల్డ్ ఈస్ నథింగ్ బట్ వార్ ఫైల్ so we built all that code into a single file and we are calling it as dot var our dot var extension id kabatti we are calling it as var AWS bean stack pricing we'll see the pricing see there is no additional charge for AWS bean stack you pay for AWS resources example EC2 instances S3 buckets you create to store and run your application in that manam create application create chesina ventane ఒక ఎన్వాయిన్మెంట్ క్రియేట్ చేసిన వెంటనే ఒక ఇన్స్టెన్స్ క్రియేట్ అయింది ఫార్ దట్ హీస్ ఛార్జింగ్ బట్ నాట్ ఫర్ సెటింగ్ అప్ ది ఎన్వాయిన్మెంట్స్ ఓకే so on the back end of bean stock he is using docker and cheptaru uh, unofficial ga but amazon never revealed reveal what he is using exactly so we will upload our source code ante var file or whatever it is to bean stack from the bean stack it will create a files var files uh, or we, we can it will uh, it will create the environments and will like development environment qa environment or staging environment or production environment and will deploy that Uh, whatever the source code we uploaded the project we uploaded into the send moments and we'll see the output but we are not recommending this elastic bean stack service for production even though we can go with production but it is not recommended way only we recommend bean stack for development environment qa environment and staging environment or testing also ante anni performance testing vaati kadandi only functional testing ki కోడ్ సరిగా వర్క్ అవుతుందా లేదా అని అంతేగాని కోడ్ కోడ్ హోస్ట్ అయిన సర్వర్ బాగా వర్క్ అవుతుందా లేదంటే సర్వర్ మన చేతుల్లో లేదు ఏడబ్ల్యూఎస్ వాడి చేతుల్లో ఉంది డిఫరెంట్ డిఫరెంట్ ఫ్లో చార్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ సోర్స్ కోడ్ ఇక్కడ ఉంది కోడ్ అంతా డెవలప్మెంట్ ఎన్వాయిన్మెంట్ క్యూ ఎన్వాయిన్మెంట్ ఎన్సిఐసిడి బిల్డ్ బిల్డ్ ఫైల్ బిల్డ్ చేశాక ఎక్కువ సోర్స్ కోడ్ నుంచి దాన్ని మూవ్ చేస్తున్నాడు ఎక్కడికి ఎన్వాయిన్మెంట్స్ కి అవి ఎన్వాయిన్మెంట్స్ ఎక్కడ హోస్ట్ అయి ఉన్నాయి ఫిజికల్ సర్వర్స్ లో ఉండొచ్చు వర్చువల్ సర్వర్స్ లో ఉండొచ్చు క్లౌడ్ లో ఉండొచ్చు అక్కడ హోస్ట్ చేశాక దాన్ని రన్ చేస్తున్నాడు రన్ చేసి అవుట్పుట్ చూస్తాడు ఓకే దిస్ ఈస్ వన్ కైండ్ ఆఫ్ లైఫ్ సైకిల్ సిఏఎన్ సిడి లైఫ్ సైకిల్ ఫ్రమ్ యువర్ ల్యాప్టాప్ this is what the scenario we are, i was going to we are going to do it with the elastic i was uploading my code to elastic bean stack and elastic bean stack is launching instances and if, if the code is not from your laptop or it, if the code is on your s3 bucket it will pull the code and it will show you the output if you want to use elastic load balancers is different scenario while creating the uh, after creating the environment while adding up the instances under the configuration part we'll have all this kind of things
create application, upload the version, launch environment and manage environment. Again, if you had new new change in your code, again upload it. Same. If you had new change in code, again upload it with different different versions. So who is launching this environment? Beanstack is launching this environment. Who is managing this environment? Beanstack is maintaining environment. Who is uploading the versions? The user, you. You have to upload your code as a versions to this environments to see and you can see the output. Who is creating the application? You. Hello.
yeah uh, it's completed it's uploading 99 percent okay now it's deploying it's setting up Okay, now I'll refresh that page. A page and day and the color. Okay, now I should get this Jenkins. Yeah, I got the Jenkins. See how fast I, I set up the Jenkins, uh, Jenkins application. Okay. administrator password password okay you file the password in there so this is how we deploy this war files on the different kind of environments okay So if I lo e server lo ikadi file lo password unta da password in the choosey kadi paste chain and chapter unde. Mana ke mana upload yes in normal website kaat kaat the Jenkins. Mana mere se SSH we cannot SSH into that server, so we cannot get that password. So we cannot create this Jenkins authentication. So my my intention of this is, as I wanted to say, we can upload different kind of versions on that particular environment. Okay. Anything else, guys, on this topic? Any doubts? Good. Okay, that's it for today class. This is all about this uh, bean stack and have a look at this uh, AWS documentations and go through the docs. Okay, we will end up this session today. Okay, bye bye, and we'll continue on tomorrow. Okay. Bye.